Okay, today I'm gonna do something, uh, maybe I'll do, do more of these. It's kitchen equipment that almost every restaurant I've ever worked in has uh, as part of their tools, but almost no one in the home cooking sector has these things. And it, it, there, it's gonna, some of these things are gonna be great for your sauces and just the way you cook in general. Uh, the first one I'm gonna start off with is the fine chinois which means fine Chinese, or they used to, you know, some people call this type of strainer, uh, usually the ones with holes. I mean, you could call it, it's colander, uh, China cap. Uh, but this one, the metal on this is fine like a cheesecloth. So if you have a sauce, maybe it has little bits of stuff that your regular strainer doesn't get out. When you put it in here, you knock a spoon on the side, ting, 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 and you're gonna get a big puddle of sludge in the bottom because this thing's really fine. Now, if you wanted to go even finer, like you're making a consomme or something, you put this, this is made for like a five gallon bucket or a big pot, so you put it like this inside the pot, line this with like 10, just keep doing cheesecloth back and forth over it, Maybe run some water through the cheesecloth first so that any little particle from the cheesecloth doesn't come in your soup. Then you put it back in the bucket and you pour your consomme or some whatever you want, man. That's going to come out crystal clear. I mean, there, there's, you know, if you have all, if it's a cloudy sauce, you know, it's not going to bring every sauce back to crystal clear, but it's going to help you. Uh, you could, you could put potatoes in here in a ladle and like force it through and just keep adding potatoes. This will give you a really fine mashed potato. I mean, this can be super smooth, super creamy, you know. That's get you laid mashed potatoes. Today's equipment tip is the fine chinois. I paid, I think, 35 or 40 bucks for this off eBay. You can spend up to 100 bucks. I mean, these things in the kitchen, sometimes the chef keeps these because guys just rip them. You know, if you rip it, the chef wants to know who ripped it rather than just it was in the pot sink. You know, uh, so anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Think about getting yourself a fine chamois.